Pats come on tomorrow. Yes. Joy Bosa talks about how that's a really great gauge, especially for guys in your position. What can you say to that? Separate the board from the men. Simple. Do you look forward to that day? Of course. Man, that's what football is. Pat, all man football. So we heard your album today. Joe Barksdale has an album. Have there any, has there been any talk about you guys collaborating? Oh man, we talk about music all the time, man. We ain't never really just sat down like let's collab, but we definitely talk about music all the time. So, so if the time presents itself, the opportunity presents itself, we definitely do something together. Okay, have you heard his music? No, I actually have. Okay. I even know how that came out. I know he do music. I know he got a real passion for music. Yeah, yeah. Me and him talk about it. Yeah, check it out. Yeah, so I think you'd be so bad. The way you guys finished last year, there's obviously high expectations for this team. How do you balance that? So you obviously can't live on the past, but you know there's great talent here. High expectations for who? Outside from that outside. That shit don't mean none of us. Ain't nobody expectation higher than our own expectations for. We out here working. We ain't worried about last year. We're talking about this year. We grinding, we grinding, we grinding. We know, we know, we know what our main goal is. We're going to obtain Every area, every area. That's what we aim to do. Come out here and get better in every aspect of the game. You can never be too good to so get better every single day. Grind, grind, grind. Try to improve on every single aspect. And that's what you do. That's what I do. That's what everybody on this team does. That's what the coaches do. We all try to get better every day. With you and Joey being such elite players, do you sort of beat off? It seems like you beat off each other. We push each other. You have that fire. We push each other. That's what it's all about, pushing each other. We try to get better. You do better, you do work so you can better things. So every day we try to come out here and push each other. Uh, uh, oh, yeah. Mel, can you speak to Chris Landrum a little bit and what he brings to that defense now that he's healthy again? Oh, uh, he brings a lot. He brings a lot of versatility. He's a, he's a top notch player. And he's going to definitely help us a lot. He, he's one of us. And he, he can make a lot of plays. And I think that's what he's going to do this year. Man, how about it, Jenna? How is he coming along? And he comes along real good. You fit in good. When you get out there with us, you got to get up speed. And, and that's what he did. He stepped right in there ready to go. And that's what it's all about. He came here from day one and wanted to learn and wanted to get better. So, so he, he got a bright future. Can you expand on that with the channel? When you say get up to speed, you mean learning the system? Yeah, yeah. You got It's a lot they throw at you at one time. And you got to learn it and be able to play up to speed. And he took all of it, kept learning, kept learning, kept learning, and never missed a beat. He's still just grinding, grinding, grinding getting better every day, and that's what you want to do. You want to keep climbing that mountain every day, and he's going in the right direction. When you say he has a bright future, what do you see there? Oh, I see a, a playmaker, really. A person who can help this ball start. He's going to go out there and make plays, and that's what it's all about. We all about making plays and having fun. At USC, he showed a real knack for knocking down passes. Is that a timing thing, an awareness thing, if you're a defensive end? That's, that's a good football player. That's what he is. He's a football player. USC, I think he's going to come here this year. Thank you.